Reaper, we keep it rough, we keep it raw, we keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper, because I'm doing good things here at Reaper. Uh, I was asked to speak on this Jawan Howard situation. In case some of you don't know, Jawan Howard went to the University of Michigan. He was part of the Fab Five. Him, Chris Weber, Jalen Rose, Jimmy King, and it was another dude. I forget his name. Um, but anyway, they were part of the Fab Five, and they played in the NBA. Jimmy King didn't last that long. And I forget the other guy's name. But anyway, J Jawan Howard went on to have a long career in the NBA. He's from Chicago, Illinois, and uh, he went on to have a long career in the NBA. And after that, he went to be an assistant coach. And then he got the University of Michigan coaching job where he starred as a college basketball player, you know. And the other night, Michigan was losing in a tournament to Wisconsin. And, you know, they lost the ball game. And I guess the Wisconsin coach called timeout right at the end to rub the score in. This is what Jawan Howard is saying that he felt. And so at the end of the game, the Wisconsin coach came up to Jawan because they always shake hands at the end and the Michigan was a little frustrated. And he started to explain to Jawan Howard and he put his hands on Jawan, you know, but it was in a non-threatening way. I mean, Jawan Howard is 6'10", about 265 pounds um, of NBA player. But it looked like the dude was explaining and he put his hands on Jawan Howard in a non-threatening way like, yeah, man, I'm just doing this and doing that. So they started arguing and Jawan Howard told him, I don't want to talk to you. Get away from me. Well, your coach stood there explaining to Juwan because like I wasn't calling time out to rub it in and blah 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 so they started to argue and then you know people came in and separated them and they were arguing and Jawan Howard because he's 6'10 retch across three or four players and gave the man a two piece the reaper keep it 1000 you know, now if he was going to two-piece him, he could have two-pieced him when he was in his face or whatever. But Jawan Howard got heated and they got separated. And Jawan Howard reached across two or three players and gave the man a two-piece. Now, I know some of you are saying, you know, where the dude came up and put his hands on Jawan and Jawan told him to... You know, I don't want to talk to you. Get the fuck away from me. Or whatever he told him. Which is cool. You know, I mean, he could have even, when the dude put his hands on him, he could have even pushed the dude out of the way. Say, man, I don't want to talk to you. Get out of my way. You know, you impede in my progress. Get out of my way. But when they got separated after they was arguing... And Jawan reached across three or four players and two-pieced him. That's when he done something wrong. The Reaper keep it 1,000. Because he didn't have to get that man a two-piece, a two-piece dinner. But he gave him a two-piece dinner. is because Jawan Howard was frustrated, too, because they lost that game. And he let his emotions get the best of him. You know, and this is what happens. So, Jawan Howard was wrong in this instance. Now, if he would have just pushed the man out the way, or he would have cussed his ass out, you know, vehemently, he wouldn't have been wrong. 
the reaper keep it 1,000. But when they got separated and they was arguing, Jawan Howard is 6'10", and Retch across, look at the film, two or three players, and the man was separated from him and gave him a two-piece dinner. The reaper keep it 1,000. And you just can't do that if you're a coach. You know, I mean, coaches have got in the fights and everything. But you got to set an example, man. You know, I mean, that man wasn't trying to fight Jawan Howard. You know, he wasn't crazy. So I think it was the frustration of Michigan losing that game. And they're going to say that he called timeout to rub in the score. Well, that's the frustration once again of Michigan losing the game because you could call timeout to celebrate it if you wanted to. It was a big win, you know, in the Big 12 Conference. You know, it was Michigan against Wisconsin, two Midwestern schools. You know, it was a big win. So if that coach wanted to call timeout to rub it in and celebrate it or whatever, that was his choice. You know, you got to play better. That's what I would have told my team if you don't want this kind of thing to happen, you know. But Jawan Howard got wrapped up in his feeling and two-piece the man. Now, that's something that you can't do. Now, punk-ass Stephen A. Smith, Stephen A. Smith, you's a punk-ass nigga. You know, you know how I feel about you, you know. Um, you was calling for Penny Hardaway's job, you know. When Penny Hardaway just told, uh, cussed at a couple of reporters, oh, Penny, you can't do that. And you was calling for his job. But you said when Jawan Howard, the two piece the man, oh, he shouldn't get fired. <laughs> just because you like Jawan Howard. And Penny Hardaway is a real nigga. And we know you ain't a real nigga. You know, you ain't got no real nigga in you. You know, the Reaper keep it 1,000, you punk ass nigga. You know, but this is what, you know, some people will do because they'll excuse people all the time with their behavior that they like. The Reaper keep it 1,000. So if I like you, you can do something egregious and I'll overlook it but if I don't like you you can do some minimal shit and I'll excuse uh, and I'll crucify you for it you know the reaper keep it 1000 so this is what a lot of these people do and you see them doing it in the world but Jawan Howard should be punished for that I'm gonna keep my thoughts to myself on whether the nigga should be fired or not. You know, the Reaper keep it 1,000 on that because you just can't two-piece a man just because you lose a game and you let your emotions get the best of you on national TV. Reaper, we keep it rough. We keep it raw. We keep it real. Make sure you subscribe to the Reaper because I'm doing good things here at Reaper. Reaper out. Peace.